Hey guys, long time no see. Welcome back to my channel, or if you're new, welcome to my channel. My name is Jillian. I have a very exciting video. Well, I think it's exciting. <gasps> Halloween! Yeah. I went and picked up some Halloween stuff because yeah. I'm starting to, don't mind the dogs, prepare for what I'm gonna do. And I've gotten a ton of messages on my Instagram and on my comments asking me if I'm gonna do Halloween inside this year. Because I didn't do it last year. I only did the... Um, shelves by my front door and I am gonna do it this year. I have so many good ideas and fun ideas So I'm really excited. So I wanted to start actually picking some things up I know it's like the end of August, but I want to be prepared. I don't want to like spend a ton of money Hold I want to be prepared. I don't want to have to spend a lot of money um, or especially like have an idea at the last minute and go out and spend a ton of money so I want to kind of get things gradually um, the stuff I mainly got for now is for my table, my dining room table, because you guys, like, know I like to spend, um, like, create some sort of storyline in my Halloween decorations, or some kind of theme. It's not just all crazy, random things. So I have a great, awesome idea, and I'm so excited. Um, as for when I'm gonna start decorating, I don't know if I can hold out till the end of September. We are going away the last week of September. Um, maybe I will hold out until then. I don't know. Stay tuned. I don't know. For now, I have, you know, the neutral fall on my table. I don't have all my neutral fall out yet. It's taken me, I mean, it's still August, you know what I mean? But I just started slowly. Pretty sure I was one of the first people to start putting out pumpkins. Do a tour of my neutral stuff eventually. And then, you know, I will start Halloween when the time is right. Um, I didn't actually do Halloween outside last year either, which I usually do. I usually do like this big thing. I think I did a video, um, but I do something different like every year. I do want to do that again because I missed it last year. And I know the kids missed it too because I know a lot of kids like to come to my house because we really deck it out. And I only kept up white pumpkins because I'm basic. I know some people don't like Halloween decor. I know some of my subscribers love it. It all depends on what your taste is. I love both. I love neutral you know, fall decor, all, all fall long, whatever you want. And I also love Halloween, so it's whatever your choice is. But this is strictly Halloween decor, except one thing I wanted to show you really quick from Home Goods on my Instagram. I wanted to get another one of these boards that had kind of like the wood trim. The other one I got was from Walmart. It has the plastic one and I actually gave that to Madison. So I found this one and I love it. I love it. You can like hang it up too if you want. Um, but it's just been sitting on my counter in my kitchen and I will be using this a lot during the seasons for different sayings because I think I'm a jokester. <whistles> anyway, so this was only, uh, I don't have the thing on it. I want to say it was only like $10, 10 to $12, I forget. And it came with a bunch of letters, so. I picked up that and I wanted to include it because I know a lot of people want to know where you can get one of these. And this is, you know, a good quality one. This is like plastic, it, well, it's not the felt one, but I like it. So the first things I want to show you are actually from the Dollar Tree. Now, a lot of the basic things I try to do for uh, tablescapes or theme tables is I try to get the necessities or the basic components of it really cheap. So I try to go to the Dollar Tree for plates, if I'm going to include cups, um, stuff like that. You know, just stuff that you can get cheap that you can make, you know, it look like that it's not from the Dollar Tree. I have nothing against the Dollar Tree. I love the Dollar Tree. So actually this year is the first year I'm actually gonna do cups. Um, I don't usually, in my table settings, um, use cups. I just I just leave them out. It's I like to do this for fun. I not, not everyone likes to set a table and not use it. I understand that. But when I do my Halloween decor, I like to make it really fun and kind of over the top. And I know that's not everyone's taste, but Halloween. I picked up four of these uh, kind of wine glass looking things for a dollar each and they're kind of tinted black. I don't know if you can tell. Um, so yeah, you don't have to go to Target and spend like $3 each on glasses. Just go, or plates. Like go to the Dollar Tree first. If you ever want to set a table or create a tablescape, sorry, I keep playing with my hair. I know you hate that. Or go to the thrift store, but if you saw my rant on Instagram, you'll know that the thrift store is becoming more expensive than like Target. So anyways, I picked up four of these because I'm going to do four table settings. Uh, 
you know what, thinking about it, maybe I should have gotten six because I have six settings, but I can always go back. I only have white plates that I use usually throughout, you know, whenever I'm doing a tablescape, um, but I wanted to pick up some Halloween colors and I picked up four of these. Like I said, I might go back and get two more, but they were all kind of scratched. I don't know if you can tell. Uh, I don't care because they're only going to be used for, you know, the short amount of time. We're not going to eat off of them or anything. Some people might think this is an extreme waste of money to buy plates that you're not going to use, but YOLO. Um, they were only a dollar each and believe me, it's better than going to another store and spending like four dollars each on plates you're not gonna said, use this is just um i have a theme in my head i'm not gonna tell you you know what i'm doing because i want it to be a surprise and i know you guys love those videos but i am gonna do something funky with these so they're not gonna stay well they're gonna stay like this color and stuff but i'm gonna add something to them to make them look a little more spooky what i went to was tj maxx and i like to look in the home decor section of tj maxx it's basically like home goods same diff but these are, this is where you can get good deals if you're trying to do something like a tablescape. They're inexpensive and the quality is usually good and it's less expensive than the thrift store these days. And I'm not sure if this is Halloween specific. I just saw it in that section. It could be used as a planter, but I thought it was the perfect witch's cauldron. It was only $7.99, I don't know if you can see that. And I have an idea for this that might not work out the way I want it to, but either way, if it doesn't work on the inside of my house, it will definitely work on the outside of my house. And it was only $8, so I wanted to pick it up because I think the idea that I have for it is gonna look really cool. So it does hang, you don't have to hang it. You could even use it for a candy bowl if that's your style. All right, so whenever I'm trying, whenever I'm doing like a themed anything, I try to start from the base, the very bottom layer. So usually the bottom layer is some sort of tablecloth. And I know that I want my colors to be black and white or gray. Um, those are just the colors that I like for Halloween. I know a lot of people like orange. If you like orange, you can do that. Some people like to throw purple in or green. It's totally up to you and what you like. But for me in my house, I like black and white mostly and some gray. So I wanted to get a tablecloth in 99. Like that is awesome. If you go to Target, no, no disrespect Target. I love ya. But their like linens and stuff are expensive, like 25 bucks for a tablecloth <laughs> uh i picked up another thing for my table this was only 7.99 and it's so cute uh people i hate spiders like i don't even really like decorating with them sometimes i will it depends on like if it looks real or not but webs are fine you know so i got this um plastic nope vinyl table runner and it's just you can see pretty long ah! and it's like spider web. So that's gonna go over the tablecloth. Um, just another layer, you guys know I love to decorate in layers. Um, I think that really adds a lot of good dimension and it makes everything look, I don't know, just more put together in my um, opinion. Some people think it looks cluttered, but hey, to each their own. So this was only $7.99. Now my original thought was I wanted to get some sort of lace to kind of mimic a what this it like looks like uh, i still might i don't know i'm not a huge fan of the plasticky look but it's halloween like calm down yeah. and i am so excited to start this table but i have to hold down i have to hold on for the right time because uh i always rant and rave about how much i love doing it early which is totally true but um in order to get in my opinion, both my neutral stuff and my Halloween stuff out in one season, I need to like just enjoy some of it for September and then take it down and do Halloween. You know what I'm saying? I can't do both because then that adds too much visual clutter for me and I, I'm like one of those people that I like a cluttery look sometimes. Like it's so hard to explain, but it has to be all cohesive and not like just thrown, thrown up. You know what I mean? You guys know I have a bunch of stuff. I am gonna incorporate some of my own stuff in my Halloween table. Um, I'm also gonna probably use a lot of brass, such as candlesticks, and um, maybe some old tarnished silver. I haven't decided yet on that, but obviously you guys will see everything that I do. I will show you everything that I do while I'm doing it because I know I don't really record 
me doing it and a lot of you guys want to see that the only problem with that is sometimes it takes me so long it could take me multiple days to get it the way i want it it's just because i'm a perfectionist and i sometimes love that part about me and sometimes i hate it because sometimes it's kind of like a burden it takes so long and this is like first world problems to the max but sometimes if it's just not right i have to keep doing it over and over and it drives me crazy and there's a lot of swearing involved so i don't really know so excited for halloween i'm so excited for fall i know everyone says this basic. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram because I've been posting more on Instagram. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye!